Lake Tahoe is known for its world-class ski resorts and outdoor activities, of course. And thanks to several local organizations, a group of disabled veterans is getting a well-deserved week of enjoying all that Lake Tahoe asked, has to offer. Now, Paul Nelson was with them today as they snowmobiled around Brockway Summit and shows us why some of them keep coming back. Snowmobiling is just one of many outdoor winter sports in the Sierra. But for these veterans, this is more than just a 15-mile tour. It's reliving an experience that reminds us uh, how grateful we are to be able to participate. These veterans have physical disabilities. Some are confined to wheelchairs, while others need canes to get around. But none of that matters when they're out here. You, know, you get to go out and do things that you didn't think you'd be able to do again. It's nice to be able to go out and... It's like you can run and do stuff like that that you haven't been able to do. So it's, it's, it's awesome. About 85 veterans are part of this group. They get to ride the snowmobile through the Tahoe wilderness and enjoy some of the best views in the area. It looks like a postcard. So it's beautiful, yeah, absolutely. We have to take more pictures. Santosha Litzenberg is here with her husband, Daniel. The Marine Corps veteran needs a wheelchair because of multiple sclerosis, and being around others with similar disabilities has its advantages. You can talk about, like, how are they dealing with with their problems, what are the different tips that they've learned or the skills that they've learned that have helped them to be able to go through life. That's why several Tahoe businesses and organizations put this tour together every winter. Achieve Tahoe is a group that encourages anyone with disabilities to get outside and be active. For those with disabilities, there's a lot of extra challenges that keeps them from being able to pursue those activities. And we want to be able to, uh, to bridge the gap for them so that they can have a, a full life. Veterans come here from all over the country. One, two, three. And tour guides say experiences like these help them live fuller lives. It's very emotional. It definitely it brings out, out a lot of everybody. It's, it's fun to watch them smile and enjoy themselves and, you know, remember why they're here. Bruce Gibbings is an Army veteran injured in a motorcycle crash. He's done this tour before and says part of the fun is seeing the first-timers. I love to see the look on their face when the, uh, the awareness comes that if I can do this, I can do anything. Covering the story, Paul Nelson, Channel 2 News.